My name's Bill Collier and I think I'm the last wooden boat builder left anywhere. I don't know of anyone else in the world who's actually still trying to build wooden racing boats. There are people producing wooden boats but they're moulded uh, as opposed to this is a a process called tortured ply but the others have uh, come out of a mould so they're all exactly the same beautifully done that they do a beautiful job but it's not traditional boat building this is what we call a gentleman's sculling boat which is a little bit more um, heavy wider deeper stronger and will take a bit more bashing than the racing boat. I've designed it about 30 years ago. It can be appreciated uh, as being individually built for the customer. I've had good times all through the 60s and 70s. I was very, very busy building boats as fast as I could. I had about up to about six or seven months waiting list uh, uh, at times in the 60s and 70s when people appreciated real boats but somebody invented plastic in the late 70s and it's it's not anymore it just isn't anymore and it is it's, it's very sad I feel honored to be the last but uh, there's there's no great honor in it I'm afraid I need to come and sort of um, hang around in case anybody wants a boat mended or whatever and um, generally socialise. I've got a few mates who come by from time to time and we, we have a cup of tea and a chat. I don't know, it's, it's in the blood I think. And uh, just generally um, get out from under my missus feet if you like. The rest of the time just sit around and watch the girls go by, which is a good thing to do. You just occasionally see, like on a Saturday morning here at uh, Richmond, a whole load of boats come by from Twiggin and Rowing Club just up the river. And just there'd be the odd, nice wooden one. And it's lovely, lovely to see. And you think, well, all is not lost. There is one or two still there. hoping for a revival you never know one day people might come to their senses and realize what they're missing it's just sort of living in hopes that someone will one day want a boat <laughs> <laughs>